All right, here we go, hole number eight. Definitely a fun hole. Should be a pretty, pretty good birdie hole. This is kind of the safest play I found off the tee is the glide roll rive forehand. Just kind of aim at that tree and then kind of flex around it and try to aim right down the path here. If you can end up anywhere in this area, then another glide roll rive will get you, should get you right to the basket. Um, but it's pretty easy to get in some trouble off the tee, and then the second shot can become pretty difficult if you get behind a house. Or um, those of you to play this hole, you definitely know that it's it's not the easiest one, and there's a lot of trouble to get yourself into. But that's kind of glide roll rive forehand, and then a glide hole rive backhand, kind of fading towards the basket. It's kind of the ideal way to get the birdie. There's lots of different lines you can go off this tee to kind of uh, that become a little more risky. You can go backhand around this tree good thing of note that tree that i'm passing right now none of those branches are really hit points unless you hit that the kind of tree dead on none of those branches will, will keep you from getting through so good thing to know but again the, you know the farther down you get kind of the more trouble you can get stuck behind the house or whatnot so it just makes the second shot a little more difficult sometimes even though you're getting closer to the basket this is just a forehand glide roll ride they got stuck on the house so not ideal there another line that can be rewarding but definitely more risky is a forehand kind of around the trees over here let me see if i can show you you can either go kind of left of all the houses or you can kind of squeeze it to the right of that house right there if you go left you're kind of just hoping for a good kick this is actually getting pretty lucky it's about as good as you can get sometimes you can get past this house on the left but kind of a blind shot but that's about as close as you can get off the basket unless you get so 175 again you can have a shot at eagle going that route but it's a little more of a risky uh, shot off the tee and try it again so it's again it's a forehand around the trees over here glide skip rive this is going to be in trouble you can see it's tough depending on the wind um, but that's another option Again, this tree over here, you can see that tree. So unless you hit that tree dead on, um, it's not going to slow you down or it's, there's no hit points. You can kind of go through the branches there. And don't have to worry about hitting them. This is going to be a little too far left. But I could probably get a birdie from there. It's a pretty safe tee shot as well if you don't want to do the forehand. You can do the, the backhand. You can you can even get if you get a nice one you can get down there to that bottom level and have a decent shot at, at the basket. This one's a little left, but it should hopefully make it down there. So from here, again, not easy, but you you got to look at the basket. This is just the river. If you can get to the corner of that red house, well, that's not too bad. Just kind of giving you ideas, different ways to, to potentially throw it in for an eagle. We'll go this way one more time, see if we can get get down there a little ways and use that. This is looking pretty good. But again, the farther down you get, the more trouble and the more houses and stuff you have to get behind. It's going to be a similar spot as the last one. Not an easy, Not an easy shot, as you can see. Forehand beast PD. Go in almost, but in, again, from those, you're either if you if you do go for the basket, you're pretty much risking going out of bounds. So the way to give you the best shot at eagle is do like a huge flex shot, glide, skip, arrive, and try to get through. If you see that, follow that path right through those houses. If you can skip on up through there, just like this. Oh, kind of caught the edge there. You can get through that gap. You can see you have a pretty good look at the basket. If I can get to the corner here. This is where I end up mostly if I try to go that route. Then I got a pretty decent chance if I'm going for it. This is going to be left. And again, if you miss it, go long, you're pretty much going out of bounds. So it's pretty rare that I'm ever going to get an eagle here, even if I have a good tee shot. It's just too risky to go at it, so I'm usually just trying to get it to fall down there close to the basket and tap it in for 
for my birdie. Again, the corner of this house is a pretty good shot. This is kind of too much stuck, stuck behind it. So I'm gonna have to go forehand. Sorry, this video is getting pretty long. Hopefully I can get it pretty soon. I'm just gonna keep trying this flex backhand to try to get through the houses there. And I think that'll give me the best shot at, at getting the eagle, showing you that it's possible. If you got the perfect win and the perfect shot off the tee, you can get quite a ways through there and maybe even skip down. That one caught the rock. Maybe even skip down closer towards the basket, but that's it's like a one in a hundred shot. Um, more than likely, even if you hit that gap, that's not good. Off the train. If you haven't got the badge, all you got to do is hit that train and get the, I can't remember the name of it, but the badge to, to hit the train. But if you can hit that gap, this is going to be way left. All right. Well, I feel like I'm getting worse now. Come on. Looking a little better, but it's going to be left to the house. I'm trying to get through that gap. But if you miss it left, it usually gets wide enough. Again, we're stuck behind the house. You can see how long this has taken me. It is not an easy eagle, but should be able to find a solid way to play this hole to come up with a birdie almost every time. But the point of these videos is to show you ace or eagle on every hole, so I'm gonna keep on chugging along until I can get that, get over the rock. Here we go. Oh, that's twice I caught the edge of that house there. Slide, should be able to slide out, there we go. This is the river, plenty of distance, should have a good height on it, but if I miss the basket, I'm pretty much guaranteed OB. This is looking good. There we go. We got it. There's your eagle. Hope you enjoyed. I'm going to move on to the next hole because I know I ain't getting it on the next try, but hope you enjoyed. One more hole for Northern Lights.